subscribe gadget filter channel and tap the bell icon for never miss any update hey youtube this is shahad shubud back once again from gadget filter channel and today i am presenting you guys a review of latest dirty unicorn roam of oneplus x so guys sit back relax and enjoy the show So before going for review there is more custom room reviews for OnePlus X in this channel. Make sure to subscribe for getting new updates of OnePlus X. So guys any further ado let's go ahead and see what we have got in this room. This room comes with June 5 2017 security patch. It is the latest patch and it's based on Android Nougat 7.1.2. So in the settings firstly we will find dirty tweaks. There you will get all of the customization features. So in the status bar option you will find ambient display, expanded desktop, device extras. In device extras you will get all of the gestures and all the gestures are working fine like draw O opens the camera, B for torch and so on. Then there is miscellaneous and power menu. Here you can add screenshot, screen record, torch and many more things to the power menu. Then there is lock screen, here you will find lock screen items like you can add clock widget, date widget, alarm text, media cover art to the lock screen as well as here you will find another option lock screen torch. By enabling this, when your screen is off, if you press and hold the power button, torch automatically will be on. After that you will get status bar. Here you can customize your status bar like you can change battery style, clock position, add career level notifications, quick settings options, ticker and traffic indicators. So the next is navigation. Here you will find buttons and navigation. You can enable, disable and customize like increase or decrease the height and weight of the navigation bars. And you will also get smart bar settings. Here you can set buttons animations, transparency etc. And the last tweak multitasking. Here you will find heads up, omni switch and recents. In recents you can add memory bar and AOSP clear option to the recent panel. Now battery. This room comes with a decent battery life. Basically I didn't find the battery backup performance is good. It's pretty much average. And the camera. Truly I didn't satisfied with the camera. Its focus time is not good. But you can take some decent photos with it. This room is pretty much smooth and fast. I didn't see any lag there. So guys that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe and I will catch you in the next one.